ejected into space without a suit. So you're chilling in your room, watching this video, and suddenly, bam, you're exposed to space without a suit. First off, the air in your lungs would rush out, and your body fluids would start to bubble due to the lack of pressure. You would feel an intense burning sensation as moisture on your tongue and eyes evaporated instantly. Within seconds, your skin would swell painfully, your organs would shut down, and your blood would lose its ability to carry oxygen. You wouldn't explode, but the sensation of suffocating and freezing at the same time would be unbearable. After about 15 seconds, you'd lose consciousness, drifting helplessly as your body continued to cool. Within minutes, you'd be a frozen statue, floating forever through the void. Frozen on Arakoth On Arakoth, the coldest object in our solar system, the temperature is so extreme that the air around you feels like it's trying to drain your warmth. At first, you'd feel an unbearable cold that hits you like a slap to the face, instantly creeping into your body like a thousand tiny needles. Your extremities would go numb, your muscles stiffening and refusing to move as the cold slowly paralyzes you. The lack of oxygen makes you dizzy, your thoughts growing more sluggish, and you begin to drift, losing control of your body. The cold feels like being trapped in a block of ice, but before you can fully freeze solid, your body succumbs to suffocation. Your remains would lie untouched for thousands, perhaps millions of years, preserved in time on that distant, desolate world, with no one left to remember your existence. Stranded on an airless moon, without air, your body wouldn't be able to breathe, and you'd start suffocating within minutes. Your chest would tighten painfully as your lungs struggled for oxygen that wasn't there. Your vision would blur, your ears would ring, and every muscle in your body would scream for relief. The pain would feel like drowning without water, your head pounding as carbon dioxide builds up in your bloodstream. Unlike freezing in deep space, you wouldn't lose heat right away since there's no atmosphere to carry it away quickly. You would remain conscious just long enough to fully experience the terror before blacking out. Eventually, your lifeless body would be left to lie undisturbed on the silent, dusty surface. Space Radiation Overload Radiation in space is invisible but deadly. If you were exposed to an extreme amount, it would start breaking down your cells, causing your skin to blister and your organs to fail. At first, you wouldn't feel anything, but within hours, nausea, weakness, and searing pain would set in. Your DNA would be shredded beyond repair, leading to internal bleeding and a slow, agonizing death. It would feel like getting the worst sunburn imaginable, but deep inside your body. Your nervous system would begin to shut down, making every movement torture. Over days, your body would start to disintegrate from the inside, with pain worsening until your body could no longer keep going. Space Junk Guillotine Space is full of debris moving at tens of thousands of kilometers per hour. A small piece of metal no bigger than a coin could cut through you like a bullet, slicing through flesh and bone before you even realized what happened. If it struck a non-vital part, you would experience unbearable pain, bleeding out in zero gravity as you struggled helplessly. The wound wouldn't clot properly, and the lack of gravity would make it difficult to stop the bleeding. If it hit a major organ or your head, it would be over in a blink but the moment before impact would be filled with terror as you saw your doom approaching. Your body would continue drifting through space, a silent reminder of how dangerous even the tiniest piece of space junk can be. Burning up on re-entry. If you fell toward Earth without protection, the air around you would compress and heat up to thousands of degrees. At first, you'd feel a rush of wind, but within seconds, the friction would turn you into a fireball. Your clothes would ignite, your skin would blister and peel away, and your eyes would burn as the heat became unbearable. The pain would be unimaginable as your nerves were scorched, but soon your body would break apart from the extreme heat. You wouldn't make it to the ground. Your body would turn to ash long before impact, scattered as dust across the upper atmosphere. Crushed by Jupiter's atmosphere, falling into Jupiter would feel calm at first, with the thick clouds surrounding you in an eerie, endless descent. But as you sank deeper, the pressure would increase rapidly, pressing down on your chest like an enormous weight. Soon, it would feel like your ribs were being crushed, making it impossible to breathe. Your bones would start to fracture under the strain, and your organs would begin to collapse. At the same time, the temperature would skyrocket, boiling your body from the inside out. The deeper you fell, the more intense the pain would become, until your body was squeezed into nothingness. Falling into a star. A star is millions of degrees hot, but you wouldn't even need to touch it to start burning. As you approached, intense radiation would cook your skin, causing blisters and burns before you even reached the surface. Your eyes would be blinded by the brightness, and your blood would start to boil as the heat overwhelmed your body. Your hair and clothing would ignite instantly, turning you into a living torch. By the time you got close, the extreme temperatures would vaporize you completely. 
your atoms would be torn apart and scattered across the star's fiery depths, falling into a black hole. At first, nothing would seem wrong, but as you got closer, gravity would start pulling on your feet much harder than your head. Your body would stretch painfully, your bones elongating, and muscles tearing as you were pulled into a thin, thread-like shape. This process, called spaghettification, would be excruciating as your body was ripped apart, piece by piece. The pull would increase until even the atoms making up your body were shredded into energy. To an outsider, you would appear to freeze at the event horizon, but from your perspective, the pain would continue until there was nothing left of you. Consumed by strange matter. Strange matter is an unknown type of substance that could destroy normal atoms on contact. If you touched even a tiny speck, your entire body could be instantly converted into strange matter, a form of matter that follows completely different physical rules. You might feel a strange tingling sensation at first, but within moments, your body would begin dissolving at the atomic level. Your cells would break apart in a way that no human has ever experienced, possibly faster than your brain could process the pain. The transformation would be terrifying and unstoppable, leaving behind nothing that resembled a human body. You would cease to exist in an instant, erased from the universe in the most alien way imaginable.